do you do with an iconic historic sign that the city won't let you take off the outside of your new restaurant? Well, you either open a restaurant with that name, right? <laughs> or you put a twist on it. The twist is what a French Minnesotan decided to do with her unique diner. This morning, to Russia Eats at Le Town Talk. So who's this? So this is uh, my Italian grandparents on my dad's side of the family. Half Italian, half French. Those are my mom's parents, um, Odette and Franck. Today, Emily Soleil is all Minnesotan, owner of Le Town Talk Diner on East Lake Street in Minneapolis. When did you start thinking, I want to open my own restaurant? Uh, when I was about six years old, mm -hmm, living in Nice. Emily was born in Marseille, lived in Nice, then Italy in culinary school. A job at the then Sofitel Hotel in Bloomington brought her here. I came here to work for them for a year, and then a year turned into 13 now, and so I'm here. Le Town Talk is a name part by choice, part by force. This sign is a Minneapolis historic landmark. It's an example of streamlined modern design dating to 1946. We thought, you know, Le will be respectful to the sign and just adding a French touch so people would understand that it is a French diner. The Le is actually attached to the building, not the sign. At least three different owners had diners on this site. Emily and her husband and business partner Ben Johnson are well aware of how those guys have become legendary in town. Is that daunting for you or is that inspiring? It was inspiring and exciting, yes, because they were successful and uh, very supported by the neighborhood and the, the community. So um, that's why we thought we'll take a shot at it. It is still a diner. They have burgers. Their version of the ham and cheese is the French croque madame. Ozzy, you don't sound French to me. No, I'm from Argentina, actually. <laughs> The Argentinian chef puts out a nice bechamel sauce, a solid niçoise salad. That's traditional from Corsica. This braised beef stew with noodles warms you up in a cold winter. Simple, casual French food. So kind of like the opposite of what people think of French food. People think of French food as fussy right. and fancy. And fancy and expensive. And, um, but it's not what we eat every day. It may be a French diner, but for Emily Soleil, Le Town Talk, is the American dream. I love it. Yes, definitely. Love it. And they're doing a nice job after one year in business over there. La Town Talk is closed on Mondays, but they're open for lunch or brunch the rest of the week and dinner and drinks until midnight. And the area of town that they're mm -hmm. in is so interesting because that part of Lake Street, you've got like an Argentinian restaurant next door. There's uh, Midori's Floating Cafe around the corner. There's an Indian place right there. Lots of good eats in that area. A lot of good eat and a Denny's. So you oh, have no. all of that stuff <laughs> right there. So she's really trying to be a neighborhood business. Yeah. She said when she opened up, it was too French. The uh, menu was too intimidating to people. It looked delicious. Yeah. 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 Very good. So we're happy, happy for her. She's so nice. So very happy for their success.